how are you? Yes, I'm very well, thank you. Can we have a moment to look out of the window? I didn't ask you how you were, sorry. I'm very well, thank you. How are you? No, I did. I did at the start. Rewind. Anyway, look out the window. Literally as if hell is about to come down on the world. It is so dark and it is during the day, guys. Perhaps because we've just had Halloween. Um, I didn't go out at Halloween because I feel like I'm getting a little too old for it. Slash didn't have a costume. Hole! This is a hole. This is a hole. Back onto it. I was in Belgium recently. Um, I went with my friend Graham, one of my BFS for life. Super fun. Lots of fun. We drove to Belgium across the, uh, no, across the sea, through the Channel Tunnel, on a train. Um, and it was an opportunity for me to do a bit of shopping. Two of the things I got I am wearing, so let me show you. This cap, which is hiding a hair full of sin. Criminal damage. Tartan, guys. I saw the tartan. Knew I had to have it. You know I love it. Actually, will I take it off? I'll take it off for you. Oh, don't look at me. Um, criminal damage. Nice like that. Boom, 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 boom. And I got this with 20% off. So it should have been 35 euros and it was down to seven off that. 28, 28 euros. Snapback, worn as a snapback, but obviously you can spin around, slip it back up. <laughs> the worst phrase ever. <sighs> anyway, next, Adidas t-shirt, 90s are back. You've heard it here first, you didn't hear it here first. You saw it in magazines and in everything. And I'm just also saying it's back. I will be wearing this with my standard skinny jeans because I am a skinny jean wearer. And again, I've got this in the sale. It was 50% off. Antwerp, you are going wild for a sale. I love you. This was 17.50. I'm looking up where I've written things down. Now, my next piece is a trend, which is big for autumn winter, and I am actually thinking about a how to wear video. So I'm gonna do a, maybe a style video where I sort of mince about a bit, do some fancy edits, a bit of mirror. You've seen the ones I do, um, and I'll show you how to wear this. And it is a roll neck. Uh, so we will be getting colder, I say, although hottest Halloween on record in the UK. Wow, spooky. I've got this one from United Colors of Benetton. It is merino wool, so it's super soft. Have a touch. <sighs> Oh, it's soft. And this, again looking at this, was 25 87 Such a random price, but such a good find. I went to, drum roll for this one, CNA. So we had CNA in the UK years ago, and it was very much the place that my mum would take me to, to pick up all the school stuff, if it wasn't Marks and Spencers, um, and pick up bits and bobs generally for children's lives. Um, but CNA is still in Europe. Yeah, I went in thinking this is a blast from the past and came out with a brand new satchel. How nice is this little leather flip down, like little briefcase, and it is so soft. And inside, you've got a little pocket for any of your bits and bobs in there. Perfect size for a laptop, if you've got a laptop. You also get a strap, which looks slightly cheap, so I won't be using the strap. Gone. Definitely using just handheld. When I get that security tag off it, I didn't steal it, I did pay for it. This is just something that's there. <laughs> it's only 25 euros, and it looks a lot more expensive. This, this is one of the pieces, this is one of the pieces that I think, in life, you see, and you think it is designer. And then someone actually says it's from CNA. Although I won't be saying it's from CNA, I'll be saying it's from Robin James's exclusive collection. Buy it now. Such a good find. Perfect again for autumn winter. Can you see it being worn with this? I can. Now, I went mildly wild with shoes in Antwerp. Now, I am a shoe fan. If you were to see under my bed right now, you would see that it was a sea of shoes. Probably too many shoes. Uh, I am gonna have to have a clear out because it's getting mildly excessive. But saying that, Antwerp just refueled and fueled and just generally stoked the fire of shoe love for me. At exactly the same time I bought this Adidas t-shirt, I rocked up to the till, I saw a box, it said 50% off on it. I said to the guy behind the till, what is in that box? And he said, well sir, in a sort of Belgian accent, you've come to me at the right time, what size are your feet? And I said, I'm size nine, show me what's in the box now. And he said, 
These are size 9, they are 50% off, and they are the shoes of your dreams. Bright green Adidas Original Tersion, Tersion Trainers, last pair, size 9. I was ecstatic. 55 euros down from 110. Hello. They are sort of like running shoes, but they fit perfect into my lifestyle of running around because I'm super busy uh, and just generally wanting a bright shoe. And then, if one pair of shoes wasn't enough, I went into River Island and I bought another pair of shoes which I've not yet worn because, guys, even for me, these are out there. These are leopard print. Leopard print, guys. Leopard print Chelsea boots. Look at these. They're super soft, really very comfy. They've got this sort of pointed toe on them. Let me show you the other one too. Uh, again on the sale, so they were down from 65, it says on them, and they were down to 25. Hello, 40 euros off. Uh, probably because no one in Antwerp is silly enough to wear leopard print Chelsea boots. As the story unfolds guys, I was leaving Antwerp and I went back into one shop called New Yorker, which is a kind of Primark sort of peacock style, not really selling this, but that means it is super cheap and when you go in, you can sometimes find something which is a piece of destiny. And that was... Mm. Now I'm calling these my Fimberlands. Fimberland because they're like fake Timberlands. They're the boots I'm gonna wear that are gonna get probably get trashed. But they again are super 90s. I think All Saints when I think of these. Not All Saints, the brand, but All Saints, the ones that sang Never Ever. Do you remember? Yes, you do. These are my 90s dream. Big, chunky, bad boys. Really very light, actually. They were 29. 95 euros and the exchange rate guys was I don't know do you know this is really difficult a lot of you watch from the US a lot of you watch from the UK some of you watch from Europe Asia everywhere do give me a shout out tell me where you're from okay exchange rate is 1 euro equals 0.78 so any of my prices just times by 0.78 and that will give you the UK price and if you're in the US, one euro equals 1.25 US dollars. So there you go. Um, so all you need to do is multiply any of this by 1.25 and that will give you the price in US dollars. Uh, and I will try and find any of these pieces online. Obviously a lot of them are in the sale, so they might be gone, but other little bits and bobs could be there. So I will search for them. I will stick links in the description, you can click away, you can go wild, you can involve yourself in my fashion dreams of Antwerp, Belgium. Thank you very much for watching, as ever please do, like it, hate it, just rate it please. Make sure you click that subscribe button, see all my videos as soon as I go live, and then jump on over right now onto my channel to see my other hair how to's, my grooming reviews, my styling hauls, tips and bits. But for now, bye bye.